Hi, I'm Jenny Klein, Independent Silver Ambassador with Plexus Worldwide, and I want to share a few tips with you on how to share Plexus with strangers. First off, remember you're here to help people. You want the best for people when it comes to their health and wellness. So do not think of yourself as a salesperson because you're not. You're someone who simply shares Plexus with others. Now, strangers are now our friends because let's face it, if we don't talk to strangers, we're never going to probably reconnect with them. Our paths are never going to cross again. And we wouldn't want them to miss out on the life-changing information that we know regarding Plexus. So it all starts off with just being plain old nice. Strike up conversations with people. But again, Plexus isn't the topic. Maybe you're waiting in line at the grocery store and you just comment to the lady in front of you, oh, I really like your jacket. That's super fun. Just get the conversation going, ask them about their day. Um, maybe it leads to conversation about their kids or what they've got going on. And more likely than not, they'll bring something up in conversation that you know Plexus can help them with. Maybe the other person will say, oh, I'm having such a long day. I can't wait to get home. Work is really exhausting me. That's when I would say, you know what? I work with Plexus Worldwide and we have an amazing supplement that gives you great natural energy. Won't keep you jittery at all. In fact, you won't believe the testimonials that you'll read about people benefiting from this supplement. Is that something you'd like to know more about? And if they say yes, that's wonderful. If they say no, don't be discouraged. But if they say yes, I hand them my phone they say, hey, are you on Facebook? Go ahead and type your name in. I'll send you a friend request. That way you can read all about it for yourself. If they're like, no, no, I'm not on Facebook. Okay, no worries. Let me just call you real quick from my phone so you have my number. What's your number, please? You type it in. Of course, you don't take the time to add them as a contact because you don't want to look like you're going to be their new stalker, but just offer that you'll text them some information. Now, if the person said, no, I'm not interested, then I switch the conversation and say, well, I'm sure you know someone who might benefit from our supplements. Let me give you one of my business cards. If you'd pass it along to someone who might be suffering, I'd really appreciate it. I'm always glad to share information without any hyper pressure. So I just chit chat with people throughout the day. And I will admit, because I'm such a big Facebook gal, I love it when they are on Facebook because we can stay in touch easier, in my opinion. However, don't let that throw you off. If they're not on Facebook and all you can get from them is a mobile phone number, that's fabulous too because you can text them. You can text them things that you would also share on Facebook just in a different way. So I want to encourage you to chat it up when you're out with people. Now let's say you're in a restaurant. Of course, you really can't stop your waiter or waitress. They're busy working. But how else are you going to share Plexus with them? It's not going to benefit you just to leave a business card with your tip because they won't know anything about it. Most likely your business card will just end up in the trash. So what I just learned, and I will credit most of these tips that I'm sharing with Diamond Ambassador Lori Harrison. She was so gracious to share these ideas with us during the Houston Super Saturday 2015 event. When they bring you your check, and of course you have to then get out your credit card and send it back with them, right on that receipt, Hey, do you or anyone you know suffer from fatigue, pain, or autoimmune or disorders? Pick whatever three topics you want. Question mark. Okay, I'll shut up now. And you just put that in with the credit card. And when they come back, they will have read that because they have to run your credit card and they have to look at the, the bill to see how much your ticket is for your meal. Most likely they're going to ask you, yeah, I am interested for myself or you know what? Yeah, my mom does have a lot of pain or my mom does have a lot of inflammation. So then it's the same protocol. Are you on Facebook? You will not believe the insane testimonials that I'm sharing from real people on how they're benefiting with Plexus. And if they say, yeah, I'm on Facebook, you hand them your phone. Okay, type yourself in. I'm going to send you a friend request. You're going to love what you see. Or again, if they're not on Facebook, okay, no worries. What's your number, hon? You type it in. Okay, there, good. Now you have my number. You can call me at any time with any questions. I'm Jenny Klein, and I'll be reaching out with you 
with more information too. Don't worry, I'm not a pouncy sales gal. There'll never be any hyper pressure. So if you can just make these little one-on-one -on -one direct connections throughout your everyday, I'm not asking you to, um, to, to do anything different in your day. Just be more aware of all the strangers around you throughout your day, the people that you can talk to and strike up a conversation with, and you'll be amazed at how you can spread the word about Plexus. Sincerely, one-on-one. -on -one. So I hope these tips have helped you. I would love to hear what your top three takeaways are. And of course, I'm wishing you cheers to better health.